This is Drew with thepodcastingstore.com, your one-stop shop for all things podcasting and remote learning. Something you may have missed and I want to draw your attention to is the London International Smartphone Film Festival, which just wrapped up this past weekend. Now, the film festival is, as the name implies, for movies shot entirely on smartphones. And uh, if you haven't seen uh, the winners of it, uh, specifically Don Heist, that one's really charming. It's about a couple of toddlers who get up early in the morning and raid the kitchen. Uh, it, it's wonderful. And it proves a point that I've been trying to make for a while now, which is quality video is in your grasp. Uh, using just the, the smartphone in your pocket, you can do really incredible things. Uh, and as far as filmmaking goes, even Steven Soderbergh, uh, back when the iPhone 7 was the uh, cutting edge technology, uh, has been making films using iPhones as well. So the big, big name directors are uh, utilizing this technology and leveraging it in different ways as well. But to think that this is going to replace traditional Hollywood shooting and then that's the next big thing in, in the direction they're all going to go in, I think is slightly missing the point. To me, what this uh, London International Smartphone Film Festival indicates to us is really more of the democratization of filmmaking, video production, and things like that. What do I mean by that? You go way back uh, in history, uh, newspapers used to be the gatekeepers of information. And uh, that was true uh, for quite some time. And But now, uh, with the internet and things like that, information's out there. Anyone who has information, has a story, has a message, can get it out there. And television and film and video media has been that way as well in that there have been, been gatekeepers. There have been obstacles in our way to keep us from being able to get our message out there. That's not the case anymore, and especially now that we're giving out awards for uh, films shot entirely on smartphones, th this is a really great thing. It means that anyone who has a smartphone and has a message can get it out there and can do it effectively and make some really quality content. Now, while this is a good thing, it also is a bad thing, meaning that if you're not doing it, you're going to be getting left behind. So, in my opinion, the, the way that this works is that since it's available out there, uh, it needs to be utilized and leveraged, whether you're putting it on um, you know, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, any of that kind of stuff. Since you can make quality video, you need to make quality video. Now, what I'm using here for making this one is my iPhone, as always, and I'm using a wireless system and a phone holder. And that's really about it. You don't even have to get that complicated. Just use your phone and, and go to town on it. I, the, the way I do it, I just, I'm trying to film things without a crew and all that kind of stuff. So if you're not utilizing this technology, you really do risk being left behind. The good news is that we can help. This is the kind of stuff that we've been doing and working on and really honing our craft and sussing out how to do it. So if you're feeling a little overwhelmed or lost or don't know where to begin, reach out. We can definitely help you. But this is really super exciting stuff. And uh, this is the kind of thing that whether you're podcasting, vlogging, teaching, anything like that, you should be leveraging this technology to get your message out uh, because it's going to do so in a really effective way. If you're facing a unique problem with podcasting or remote learning, we can help. Reach out to us at thepodcastingstore.com and we'll see what solutions we can find for you. And if you like what you hear, do me a favor and tell a friend. Follow us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and sign up for our e-newsletter and you'll never miss another podcast or video again. This is Drew with thepodcastingstore.com. Thank you for listening.